Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Access has built-in help that can greatly reduce the time and cost of technical support. The help functionality is quite extensive. It contains a searchable database of help files and a table of contents. You can access the help in Access by clicking the Microsoft Access Help button that appears at the far right end of the ribbon. The button's face looks like a white question mark within a small blue circle. Clicking this will open the Access Help window. Notice that this window can be closed by simply clicking the X in the upper right corner of the window once you are finished using the help files. Now to search through the help files for a topic, you can easily type the words for which you wish to look into the long white text box in the toolbar at the top of the window. You can then decide where you wish to search for the information by clicking the drop down arrow that appears to the right of the search button and then selecting a choice from the drop down menu of choices. To perform the most comprehensive search possible, you would want to select All Access. However, if you do not have internet connectivity, then you may want to instead choose Access Help from the content on your computer. Now once you've selected where to search, just click the search button to let Access search for the words or phrases that you entered in the selected location. Any matching help topics are then displayed in the Access Help window as a listing of hyperlinks. You can click on the name of a help topic to view its content within the Access Help window. To go back to the main listing of help topics, just click the Back button that appears in the toolbar at the top of the window to return to the list. You can then continue reading other topics, perform another search, or simply close the window. Now if you wish to read a bit more comprehensively about a particular topic in Access, you can instead use the table of contents to research help topics. To do this, simply click the Show Table of Contents button that appears in the toolbar to display the chapters within the Access Help in a separate panel at the left side of the Access Help window. You can then click on the name of a chapter, which is shown in the listing as a small purple book, in order to display the pages within that chapter, and also any additional subchapters within the main chapter. Now the pages display the small blue circles with the white question mark within them. You can click on the name of any page shown in the table of contents to display your selection in the main Access Help window. Now should you want to print any topic that is displayed in the main Access Help window, you can do so by simply clicking the Print button that appears in the toolbar at the top of the Access Help window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.